it's Titanic Feet Jack, and I'm back at you again with another video. I'd like to welcome you guys back to the channel. If you want to continue to follow me along this journey as I build my sneaker collection, here's a list of my socials down below. Also, if you want to interact with me, you can also do that in the Friendly Vibes Discord group. Here's the Instagram page right here. Or if you have any questions on the group or if you want to see what it's about, DM the uh, Instagram account right here or you can ask myself. This group helps me get a lot of the sneakers I have obtained in my collection for retail or close to it. And y'all know I do have a unique size. And I ask that you hit that like button, drop a comment in the comment section. Let me know what you think of today's video. Also, hit that notification bell if you don't mind so you'll be notified every time I upload a video right here on YouTube. Yes guys, today we're going to be taking a look at a couple different sneakers. They are set to release like November the 25th on the Nike sneakers app. However, I found them sitting in my stores early and you know, I picked up a couple pairs of them and we're going to look at them. The first one, uh, just go ahead and show you the box, is a regular Nike box. Orange box, white lettering and this is the box tag for this one. And it reads Nike Dunk Low Color Gorge Green, Gorge Green and White. This is a size 10 and a half. And I believe these will retail at 120 US dollars. We have a fold over box top. And if you look closer, you can see that red lot stamp right there. There you go, guys. And we have that white tissue paper, like a penny with a hole in it. And that is it for the paper. And there is no YDM sticker in this box. So without further ado, let's get into the Here shoe. we go, guys. We have the Nike Dunk Low. We're going to tag these, the Miami Hurricanes. Uh, Take a look at the sneaker overall. My overall thoughts of the sneaker. I wish I had more hands. I give these sneakers four thumbs down. Uh, I'm not feeling the leather quality on these and also I'm not feeling the orange colorway on here it's Supposed to be a Miami Hurricanes, but this look more like I'm Working on the side of the highway hanging signs or something along Interstate 10 This is like that safety orange or like I'm working for the local utility company like Intergy and I'm trying to get the power back on but Let's get into the sneaker anyway. We have that gorge green colorway on your overlays, your swoosh, your, your lace eyelets, and your mud guard. Also, you have that safety orange on your quarter panels, your toe box, and your tongue. And looking at the midsole, the midsole is white with that gorge green at the very bottom, which leads to your outsole. We have it all Large green outsole, regular Jordan 1 or Nike Dunk outsole. There you go, guys. And we're going to turn our attention to the heel of the sneaker. There you go. We're going to start with the heel bags. We have that gorge green heel bags with safety orange Nike uh, branding is stitched on. Also, we have that safety orange going around the heel and it's topped off with that gorge green coming from the other side, which leads us to the medial side of the sneaker. More of that gorge green on your overlays, your lace eyelets, and your swoosh, and going around the mud guard. Safety orange on the quarter panels, and that little hit around the heel. And on the toe box, guys, looking at the midsole, again, we have that white on the midsole with the gorge green at the very bottom. And we're gonna make our way to the toe box, but first, here we go, it comes stuffed with paper. There you go. And looking at that toe box, let me know your thoughts. This how it looks when you press on it. I'm getting a real plastic feel. Ugh. Looking at the uh, tongue of the shoe, it is nylon. All the way up a uh, nylon tongue. And it does come with one set of laces. These safety orange laces. And it's like those speed type laces. And you have a woven patch up top of the tongue and it is in that safety orange colorway with gorge green Nike branding up top and you also have gorge green trimming or piping around the top of the tongue flip it around here you go 
save the orange with the guards green right on the other side of the tag and we do have guards green sock liner going all around and here's your insole guards green insole safety orange nike branding guys and you do see that size sticker in there and i'm going to attempt to get a look at that sizing tag for you guys so we can see when these were produced oh uh, this is a ten and a half again on the sizing and the production date was March the 30th of this year to June 21st of this year. So almost three months of production with these. Try to get a photographic look for that. Oh, there y'all go. Yeah, that's it. So that's what it looks like. On that size of the tag, look at it. it. Comes in a regular Nike box. Here's that box label. And I'm gonna read it out loud to you. It says Nike Don't Glow Retro Color University Gold. And this is a size 10 and a half. I believe these retail at 110 or 120 US dollars. Here's a look at that lot step right here in red print. And you got white paper, smooth on one side, a little rough on the other. Wouldn't want to wipe my box with this paper, and we do not have any YDM stickers in here. This is the box, so let's bring out the sneakers. Here we go, guys. We have the Nike Donk Low in the Arizona State University colorway. Go Sun Devils. Uh, quick little sneaker for the summer. There you go. Let's get into it. We have your University Gold overlays. You also have a University Gold swoosh and going around your uh, your mud guard and your lace eyelets. You have some maroon color leather on your quarter panels going around your heel as well and on the toe box. Looking at the midsole, white midsole, University Gold at the very bottom and it leads to the outsole. Nike Dunk Low Outsole, University Gold. This is what it looks like. And now we're going to look at the heel of the sneaker. You have Nike embroidered in burgundy colorway on top of University Gold heel badge. You also have that burgundy colorway going around here as well. University Gold around the bottom of the heel and the top of the all. You have that white and gold University midsole. And we're going to turn to the medial side of the sneaker. You have University Gold again over your overlays and your Nike swoosh going on those lace eyelets and around the mud guard. You have that burgundy color weight on your quarter panel and midsole white University go at the very bottom. Oh, uh, it comes stuffed with this tissue right here. Regular tissue that is stuffed with. And looking at the uh, leather, very poor quality leather in my opinion. Very poor quality, so. You may like it, some like it, or love it, but I'm not a fan of it. Comes with one set of laces, these burgundy wine looking laces. And we do have a, a nylon tongue, nylon tongue in that sand burgundy colorway. And we do have a woven patch stitched on with the Nike, uh, in Nike branding in the University Gold colorway. Also on top of the tongue, we do have the University Gold piping. And inside of the tongue is University Gold with a burgundy patch. University Gold writing. Sock liner, University Gold all the way around. And the insert is, guess what? University Gold. This is what it looks like on the inside. You see that size is sticker as well. And you do have a burgundy Nike branding. Let's see if we can get y'all a look at this tag. Bear with me, guys. I'm trying to get to this tag. It says size 10 and a half. Production date is April the 12th to May 18th of this year. So about a month of production with these. Not a very long time. Not sure how many pairs are circulating or were made, but these are sitting in the store. Good little shoe for the summer, I guess. Or if you an Arizona State University alum, i.e. James Harden, there you go. Or 
you could be on the staff for the former NFL coach Herm Edwards. You play to win the game. So that's it. So you've seen both sneakers. You have the Miami Hurricanes and the Arizona State Devils. Both are set to come out November 25th on the Nike website. However, check your local stores. I found both of these sneakers sitting around in my local stores, guys. So let me know your thoughts on these two sneakers in the comment section. And like I always tell you guys, if you can help somebody get a sneaker, help them get that sneaker because you never know when it will be your turn needing a sneaker. I'm Titanic Feet Jack, signing out.